This expedition will explore the third largest body of water on Earth, the Indian Ocean. More than 6,000 miles wide, it covers 13% of the world's surface. It's home to 5,000 species of fish, many unique to this sea. But it's an ocean on the edge. Global pressures like climate change and overfishing threaten to push it to a tipping point. The teams come to the Western Indian Ocean to find out what effect these changes are having. Environmentalist Philippe Cousteau is the grandson of ocean pioneer Jacques Cousteau. He'll be investigating the threat to one of these water's greatest predators. By removing them in such large numbers, that has drastic impacts on all the other species underneath it. Maritime archaeologist Dr. Lucy Blue will experience the treacherous effects of the unpredictable currents here. She hit this reef behind us and then broke her back. And marine biologist and oceanographer Tuni Mato will explore what can be done to save this pristine wilderness. What we're looking at here is almost the Indian Ocean equivalent of a garden centre. The expedition begins off the southern coast of Mozambique. Paul and Tooney have come here in search of the largest population of manta rays in the world. We actually stand a chance here of, of being right alongside or underneath or right with these huge mantas. I mean, some of them are about five or six metres. Eight and, metres? And there's talk eight of the... Metres. I'm going for a giant eight metre one. Yeah, eight metres across. This is a huge fish. And um, yeah, it's very exciting indeed. The team's been brought here by a mystery. 76% of the manta rays here have been attacked by sharks. Attacks that should have decimated their numbers. So how have they survived? Ready, ready, ready. It's a beautiful sight. 